everybody. So a quick tip for Tuesday is adhesive sheets. I thought I did a video on this one, but I couldn't find it. So all of our adhesives are on page 162, and I love our adhesives. The multi-purpose liquid glue is one of my favorite, but adhesive sheets come in second for me because I use them for everything. But a friend asked me how to use them, and I thought I would do a quick video with my favorite stamp set, which is the Ice Cream Corner Sweet. And these are the adhesive sheets. They come 12 in a package, 12 by 6. And you can cut them to any size you want. So I thought we would make an ice cream cone for my, um, for one of my envelopes. So we'll have to find an envelope to put it on. Oops, that's not the right size. Not the right size. I am batting out today. Let me try another spot. I usually keep all my envelopes in one spot so I can get to them. So here are some envelopes. Let's put these over here. So you get your sheets and you cut them just a little bit smaller than what you want to put them on. So I'm going to use some of the Ice Cream Corner Sweet DSP and you just peel off one of the sides of the adhesive sheet. So you expose the sticky part. So it is kind of hard to keep your fingers out of it, but you know, just do the best you can and put it on the opposite side of the side you want to use. So I want to use the really pretty other, you know, I want to use this side for my ice cream, for my ice cream cone. So what I do is I burnish it so that it um, releases all of the adhesive onto your designer series paper. So just go over it and you can I don't know if you can see it or not, but you can see where some of it's sticking. And maybe if you do it with a sideways motion. If you're cutting with your dies with this, the pressure of the machine will actually um, press your adhesive into your paper. But since I'm using a punch, I figured I better do this. So you just want to come in with your punch. I love this punch, isn't it so cute? So, I'm going to get as much as the printing. I like this down here, but I like this. Oh, isn't that cute? I like that one. So let's punch this out. So, you just punch it. And we're going to put this to the side because I need the bottom of my ice cream cone, right? I need this piece. So, again, you just take your, get the right side here, pull your pieces of protective layering off. And you can tell that it's really, really sticky. So then, oh, it's so hard to cover up these ice cream cones. But just cover your eyes and do it. It'll be worth it. So then just press it some more. So that you get a lot of, you know, you want all of your adhesive to stick to your designer series paper. So then you just want to come in. This side and just punch so you have the bottom of your ice cream cone so all you want to do is you want to just peel the other side and there is your adhesive so you just want to lay it down and come back in Oop, I should have my ice cream I remember my ice cream cone is bigger than my um, my ice cream is actually bigger than my cone, so I better move that over just a little bit. And then you just want to peel this. You can get started with your fingernail, or you can take your pick tool and pick that off of there. And then just put your ice cream. Oh, I'm sorry, I forgot to show you that. So if you can see this, see how sticky it is? That's where your adhesive is. It's in between those two pieces. So then you just... Lay that down. Isn't that cute? Then you can, like I did with mine, I did this one right here. I just stamped right over top of it with the treat yourself. And I know I showed you a tip on this. 
See how mine is stuck to that envelope really well and it's really flat and this has kind of, you can see it's coming up. All you do is you put this in your cut and emboss machine in between the two plates, run it through and it presses it almost into your paper so it doesn't come off if you send it in the mail like that. I usually almost always send my cards in the um, clear envelopes that Stampin' Up! sells. It just keeps them nice, you know. I, I want my envelopes and stuff to be nice by the time it gets to the person that I'm sending it to. So if you have any more questions or there's a product that you need help with and you don't know how to use it, leave me a message, a comment on my YouTube channel, on my Facebook page, or send me an email. I do like to make videos, so, and I do have a YouTube uh, video on this, so if you haven't seen it, go and check it out. Talk to you soon.